It's a true story based on Lisa's experiences. So she lost her husband about two years ago now. She was the first person to see the experience at the premiere. And obviously it was quite overwhelming for her, but she's, it's all part of her process and how she's dealing with these feelings and these emotions. When you're absolutely in it, you're literally in my head. And I'm crying and I'm drinking wine and I'm eating jelly beans and I'm talking to Aaron you know, for hours and hours. And really, he let me flip. So what you're getting is a snapshot that can never happen again because it's that time right after Eric died when I'm that raw and I'm that in it because your memories do fade and they do start to go away and it's terrifying and I knew that this project would be something that would help me retain some of that and hold on to Eric in a different way. When I see people come out and they're crying but they also have this light in their eyes. I see this light. It's like their hearts have opened up and they look discombobulated but also awake. No one can understand that feeling of just like deep, I don't know, sorrow, but also like that happiness of remembering them so clearly. Because they're not there anymore, but if you can remember them, that's like still being able to hold on to them. It doesn't have any mercy. Like it really makes, it made me really open up. Like I came out in tears. The moment when Eric dies, he's, his body just explodes out into all these different fragments. So when people come out of the experience, they take the headset off, they actually connect with the physical part of the installation at the same time. So they kind of, kind of like, I get it now, I understand like this explosion of, of fragments around me. What I just saw was one of the most beautiful, most powerful things I've ever seen. Uh, I knew Eric really well. I'm one of Lisa's best friends. I guess over time you start to forget things and this just made him come back. Um, I, mean, I felt like he was right there. In a lot of ways, this is very cathartic for me. Um, I don't know if I necessarily have dealt with what happened because it was so traumatic. Um, I know this has been traumatic for Lisa, and just to see her go through her journey the past couple years has been really tough. Um, but I think in some ways, Eric was put on this earth to, uh, to teach us something, some sort of lesson to learn from it, to grow from it. This was really amazing because I just kind of felt like in some ways I was able to actually see him um, alive again because I never got to say goodbye to him. Incredible what, what you guys did and I just want to say thank you because it allowed me to, uh, I guess, kind of um, get some closure around his death. So this has been, uh, it's been emotional but it's been very helpful and, and healing. So thank you.